This is Brian here. Uh, we got the 2011 Chevy Avalanche. I put new uh, wheels and tires on it and my tire pressure monitoring system uh, will not recognize the tires. I'll go ahead and turn the key on here and we will dial. You can see I had the notice there. If we go to our tires, um, we'll get there. There it is. Uh, you can see there's just dashes where it's not recognizing front or rear the tire pressures so I have the EL50448 I've got a weak battery so we're gonna see if this thing will work uh, it's supposed to help learn the new codes on new tires for this system so the 2011 Avalanche to put it into learn mode uh, we want to press the parking brake and then we want to turn the key to on not started but on now First thing I'm going to tell you to do is roll the driver's side window down. Yesterday I tried this and uh, my doors locked and the window was up. I closed the door, keys were locked in the truck. Now, we have to push both of the lock and unlock buttons at the same time and hold them till the horn beeps. And I can't hold the phone and do that with both hands. So, not skilled like that. Maybe I can. Let's do it this way. Okay, we're going to try this. There, you heard the doors lock. Okay, now it says tire learning active, and we're going to go to you see my door locked there the front tire and right by this stem right here. And you will notice this light is lit up, letting you know this is the one we're working on. Hold it right here and push the button. It learned that one. Yeah. Thank you. I'm trying to get my tire pressure monitors learned here. So. What's that? Uh, yeah, these are new tires, so it don't know these uh, monitors. Hey, every time you hear the horn chirp, you've learned the new one. You notice that backlight's not on. This backlight is on, letting us know we're back to this one. And two chirps lets us know that we're done. So unlock our door so we can get back in here. Now, here we go. Look at that. Rear tires, left 41, right 41. And go back through, cycle through. There's the front tires, 41, 41, and rear tires, 41 and 41. Uh, this is the uh, EL50448. It was roughly 75 bucks. Um, well worth its money. Even with a low battery, uh, a low 9 volt battery, it don't come with one. Uh, it did the job and it did it, as you can see, in a very fraction of a moment. So, we are finished with that project. Awesome. Highly recommend this. Now I've got it to use on any and every tire that I ever have a problem with.